Remember playing sport in school? You're in the gym or on a field. You're all crowded together and some team captains start to pick people one by one to be on teams. If you're not great at sports, you watch as each person gets picked before you and then finally you're the last one standing there. Or if sports is your thing and if your best friend is doing the choosing, you are never the last to be picked. People look at the outward appearance, but God looks at the heart. He looks deeper. He chooses us and calls us. He resources us for the mission. He never leaves us or forsakes us on the journey. We face challenges, but not alone. God always has a plan for us. When we're in the deepest pit, He is there. When we're on the mountaintops of life, God is there. He has blessings for us in every season. God brings promotion. Joseph had favor when he was in prison. God's favor took him from prison to the palace. God gives protection. Moses had favor as he led the Israelites out of Egypt and into the desert. God protected them from their oppressors. God entrusts provision. The Israelites received manna in the desert. The disciples found coins in the mouth of a fish. God gives us his presence. God's people throughout time have been marked by his presence, shown to be favored by signs, wonders, and miracles. The Bible speaks of moments of blessing from beginning to end, that Jesus increased in wisdom and in stature and in favor with God and man. For you bless the righteous, O Lord, you cover him with favor as with a shield. God opposes the proud, but shows favor to the humble. For the Lord God is a sun and shield. The Lord bestows favor and honor. No good thing does he withhold from those who walk uprightly. He has sent me to proclaim freedom for the prisoners and recovery of sight for the blind, to set the oppressed free, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. 2023 is the year of the Father's favor.